The Duchess of Sussex celebrated the impending arrival of the royal baby with a spectacular baby shower in New York this week, costing an estimated $500,000 in total. Pregnant Meghan, 37, who is expecting her first child with Prince Harry towards the end of April, hired Repeat Roses, an organization which reworks flower arrangements at the end of events and donates them to charity. And now the waste-reducing business have shared an array of stunning images to their Instagram account, which shows their workers collecting the arrangements from inside the opulent $75,000 a night penthouse in New York's Mark Hotel. They then delivered the Remedel bouquets to charities which included pediatric patients staying in the Ronald McDonald House Charities of New York, who described the surprise gift as a ray of sunshine. Pictures show the beautiful bouquets including Meghan's favorite pink peonies colorful roses, white poppies, red and purple tulips, roses, rhododendrons, and yellow lilies. Touching snaps show children and elderly patients beaming as they pose alongside the lavish flowers donated to them. Repeat Roses are not a florist but an organization who collect flower arrangements at the end of events to avoid waste, and match clients with charities they wish to donate the flowers to. The organization break down the arrangements and break them down into smaller bouquets to hand out to the chosen charities, with prices starting at $1,750. Megan arrived for her brief weekend in New York last Friday, but kept a low profile ahead of her celebrations. On Wednesday Amal Clooney and Jessica Maroney were among the guests who made an appearance at the lavish five-star Mark Hotel in snowy weather. Human rights lawyer Clooney was photographed walking into the Manhattan Hotel in a bright red jumpsuit and gold heels with a black coat over her shoulder. Canadian stylist Jessica Maroney, whose daughter Ivy served as a bridesmaid at Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's wedding, arrived with a smile as the snow fell. Abigail Spencer, who starred in the U.S. drama Suits with Meghan, was also spotted arriving at the hotel. Earlier in the week flowers were seen being delivered to the hotel with a single bouquet of pink roses seen being delivered from Upper East Side Flores Lady Fleur NYC, thought to be worth up to $400. The donation is another thoughtful and generous gesture by the Duchess, who is passionate about reducing waste and an active advocate of various charities. On Thursday Gail King revealed on CBS This Morning that she and other guests were taught how to arrange flowers at the party, and that Markle then donated those arrangements to various charities. King's co-host Bianca Goladriga said, Meghan Markle's friends threw her a baby shower in New York yesterday, a couple of months before her due date in April. She arrived at the Upper East Side venue yesterday amid tight security. The party included some big-name guests including Amal Clooney, Serena Williams, and our very own Queen Gail King. We all each made an individual vase. And then Meghan, at her request. They got in touch with an organization I've never heard of with, Repeat Roses, and they're all donated to different charities. I thought that was a very sweet thing. King then added, it just speaks to who she is. She's kind, she's very generous. And a really, really sweet person. Following the fun celebrations, Meghan was boarded a private plane back to London, where she was seen being collected in the early hours of Thursday morning. On Monday Kensington Palace confirmed that Meghan's travel for the six-day trip had been privately funded because it was a personal getaway. Self-made Meghan's successful acting career and starring role on hit legal drama Suits Men was already worth an estimated £5 million before she met Harry.